All right, so we're going to go ahead and get started. It is uh, 2 o'clock Central Time, 3 o'clock Eastern. Uh, this is going to be a presentation here on uh, Shell Bank, right? And so we're going to be talking about uh, everything that kind of goes along with it, what it's all about, and, uh, you know, exactly how it works, right? And in doing so, I'm going to be doing some screen sharing. I'm going to be doing some uh, talking about different bullet points, uh, that are part of the company. And I'm also going to attempt to share uh, some of my own uh, personal account, as well as how to uh, make a withdrawal. I want to try to make a live withdrawal on here for you guys. And uh, just like everything else, this is being recorded. This is going to be broadcasting everywhere, right? And so we're going to have these meetings uh, every single Friday around this time. And uh you know, and this is the first of what will hopefully be uh, many, many meetings uh, into the future where, where we'll be discussing Shao Bank. We'll be discussing, uh, you know, just the, the, the opportunity, the potential and uh, kind of all of the different things that they do. And uh, I do have a game plan here. So uh, we and we do have a lot to cover. Right. So strap in. Make sure you've got your notebooks out. Make sure you're getting ready to take notes. Make sure you've got your pens and pencils handy. Uh, before I get started, you should know that I am not a financial advisor. I am not going to be held liable for any decisions that you make. Um, and the risk with any type of investment is that you lose all of your money. That's the risk, right? And so don't ever invest anything into any platform or any investment opportunity that you cannot afford to lose because that's the risk no matter what. OK, and uh, that needs to be said for uh, obvious reasons. So the first thing that we're going to go over is the Shao Bank ecosystem, right? Uh, Global Future Enterprise Group's history uh, dates back to 2006, right? And uh, financial partners history since 1988, right? So Shao Bank isn't just something that popped up overnight. It's not just like this new crypto thing that just came out and doesn't have any history. There is a lot of history here, right? There's a lot of history with Shao Bank, and uh, we're uh, obviously going to be getting into that. And so what we're going to do is I'm going to go ahead and turn on my screen share uh, so that you guys can see uh, see my screen and see what's going on. All right, and here we go. All right, so this is uh, Shao Bank. Learn more about partners and the ecosystem. Shao Bank is a subsidiary of uh, Global Future Enterprise Group Corporation. We innovate, we grow, and we generously share our profits with our clients. Okay, Shao Bank provides remote banking services to the public, deposits, bonds, and loans. Right. In addition, we offer profitable customer loyalty programs, a system of token accrual, and rewards of up to twenty percent for building an affiliate network. Since 2022, we've overseen and ensured the development of the entire ecosystem of the corporation in China and around the world. Okay, so get to know Shao Bank's partner structure. Shao Bank is part of the Global Future Enterprise Group Corporation ecosystem with a history dating back to 2006 and financial partners since 1988, right? You've got the Global Future Enterprise Group, a parent corporation that oversees companies in the banking, insurance, and investment industries. You've got Go Insurance, a subsidiary of Financial Partners Limited, provides life, health, account, and business insurance services since 2013. Also got Financial Partners Limited, an investment company, part of the Global Future Enterprise Group Corporation. It operates at the financial and insurance sectors. You've got Beijing Global Future Technology and Culture. Global Future Technology and Culture, a techno uh, technology company, part of the Global Future Enterprise Group Corporation, a Class A enterprise. You've also got uh, Universal Century. Universal Century Beijing, an advertising agency that has been unanimously recognized in writing by all industry authorities in China. So it says, how do I become a partner? You can take advantage of a partnership with an emerging, uh, emerging international neobank that is a major contributor to uh, global future corporation ecosystem. Xiao has earned the trust of its customers through its integrity, impeccable reputation, and outstanding achievements in the banking industry. So they are looking for professional partners, and uh, there's a, 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 a button here to send them an offer. Now, as far as uh, actually joining Xiao Bank, 
uh, you are going to have a, a, you know, an ability to do that here. And uh, that's something that we're going to be incorporating into uh, every single one of these meetings is the uh, the link to join, uh, which I will share with you guys uh, here in the chat momentarily. Shaw Bank is a member of the Compulsory Deposit Insurance System. The location is Hong Kong. And uh, then they also have the documents, which I believe is the next thing that uh, we are going to uh, click into. All right. So uh, while we're getting ready to do that, uh, I want to actually pull up a link to join because there's no reason for us to go over everything without me providing a link for you guys to join. So in case uh, anybody hasn't yet joined and you're interested and you want to be a part of it, I uh, definitely want to provide that for you. So bear with me for just one second while I get that ready. All right. And this is going to be the Shao Bank. Okay. And let me see. I'm just going to post this in the chat. So, boom. There you go. You guys want to check out Shao Bank? There it is. You can uh, join for yourself uh, at any time during the broadcast, or you can wait until after the broadcast and, and get the, uh, the link and click it there. Check it out there. All right. Now, let's go on to the next uh, portion of the meeting of uh, things that we have to cover. The next is going to be the Shao Bank Banking. And uh, let's see what we want to uh, discuss on this one. Shao Bank Banking is uh, all about how Shao Bank earns money, right? So the financial report shows that Shao issues bonds to invest capital in real businesses, right? Namely, all the companies in the ecosystem. Also in FR, you can see how much the bank has profited from the companies in 2023. So that's in the uh, that's going to be included in the document. So we're going to take you uh, over there now. Uh, to see that. So let me go ahead and get that screen share back up. There we go. All right. So all uh, banking online, handle your finances the way you're used to, right? Make deposits, invest in bonds, take out insurance policies with Shao Bank, right? Register a personal account and manage your money from your mobile device, laptop, tablet, or smartphone, anywhere in the world. In our secure third-party protected app, you can safely monitor your accounts and earn profits, right? And then there's the button to open the account. If you do want to open your, your account, make sure that you click the link uh, that I sent to you there in the chat. Open bank statements. We keep the bank's financial statements in the public domain. Thus, before investing in Shao Bank's instruments, every client can personally verify that the institution is reliable and stable. Digital banking is always with you. Save time on your financial transactions. All your digital banking needs can be fulfilled in one click. You can make deposits, purchase bonds, accrue income and tokens, withdraw profits, transfer funds to other bank customers, and purchase money in cases for tokens. Analyze your income, control your spending, and get a holistic view of your finances, right? And then you can also download the financial report here, right? Opportunities to do business with Shao Bank. Uh, they've got the banking opportunity, right? Uh, Shao Bank is a Hong Kong subsidiary of the Chinese corporation Global Future Enterprise Group, established in 2022. It is a modern, mobile, and fast-growing bank with a focus on online services. We provide an extensive range of services for individuals and companies worldwide. We offer customers innovative uh, cooperation opportunities, bank deposits, sales of securities, lending, insurance, business network earning opportunities, and token rewards. The branch has over 1,100 employees. Shao Bank's share of capital is used to finance microloan outlets in Hong Kong and expand the activities of the Global Future Enterprise Group ecosystem. All companies in the corporation's ecosystem are regulated by government agencies. Furthermore, Shao Bank holds a banking license uh, that strictly complies with the law, right? All of this material is read verbatim off of their website, okay? All right, so let's go ahead and crack into the uh, the next portion here. Let me actually stop this for a second. And uh, we'll get ready to go into the next portion of the uh, Shao Bank overview. Just want to make sure that I'm hitting everything in order. And when I do get to the bonds, I want to make sure that I go over my uh, current U.S. numbers. Because all of this is done in Hong Kong dollars, which can be confusing for non-Hong Kong people. So... People living in the West, right? People living in the U.S. And I actually have a special uh, slide that I want to share that talks about the, uh, the current FP bond series, right? It puts it in U.S. dollars, right? And that makes everything a lot more easy to understand. 
right? And so let me go ahead and uh, find that here for you. Okay, the new bonds, I believe, are right here. Yep, here we go. All right, this is awesome, guys. Now, this is the real sauce, right? This is the real information. So I need you to really dial in and pay attention to what we're going to talk about here because once we, this is how you really make money with Shao Bang. And I've been making money with this thing every single week since I've been a part of it since last year. Right. I don't know if you uh, if you guys saw the ad, I won the YouTuber of the Year Award in 2023 for the work that I do for Shao Bank on my YouTube channel. Right. Where I talk about Shao Bank at least once a week. And I talk about all of the really large sums of money that I make from my Shao Bank bond. So I'm a personal member of Shao Bank. I'm also a bond owner. Right. And I'm going to be going over these bonds with you uh, right now. So let me go ahead and uh, get the screen share started here. We find it. Here we go. I like this because this is done, right, in U.S. dollars, right? So here we go. You got the Bond Series FP1 through uh, FP8. And I'm going to go over all of these. We're going to talk about the cost, and we're going to talk about the potential profits that could be made from purchasing these bonds. How do you purchase the bonds? Use the link that I put in the chat. Go to the site. Sign up. And you'll click on bonds, and then you'll be able to actually purchase the bonds Everything is crypto in, crypto out, right? So with Shao Bank, you got to have that crypto popping, okay? You got to know what you're doing with crypto. All right, Bond Series FP1. Uh, this is awesome. You've got a daily income. And when I say daily income, I mean, this is the passive income that you make from partnering with Shao Bank, putting your money into the bonds, becoming a bond owner, you make this income daily. You can pull the income out at any time, all right? And I'm going to do that with you here live somehow. I just have to figure out how to make the live withdraw without actually showing you all of my banking information, right? And that's the, that's going to be the tricky part. So uh, that's going to be interesting when we get to it. It'll be uh, at the end of the uh, presentation here. So we got the Bond Series FP1. All right, daily income 0.5%. Term, four years. Accruals, once every 24 hours. The principal is included in payments. Look at this. You can get one of these bonds for as low as 50 one dollars right that is super low that means just about anybody can get into this right because we talk about never invest what you cannot afford to lose most people can afford a 50 dollar investment right i'm just gonna go out on a limb and say that okay and the daily income's great so even if somebody just wants to put their toe in a little bit hey you can start making great gains daily gains from only 50 dollars Pretty awesome. Bond Series FP2, you've got a daily income of 0.6%. The term is four years. The accruals are once every 24 hours, principal included in payments from $256, right? That's the FP2 Bond Series. You've also got the Bond Series FP3, daily income 0.7%. The term is three years. Accruals once every 24 hours, principal included in payments, and you can get into that one from 1,025 USD. All right, Bond Series FP4, daily income 0.9%. This is daily now, guys. Term three years, accruals once every 24 hours. Principal included in payments, you can get in from 5,128. This is the one that I have, right? I've got the Bond Series FP4. It's 0.9% is almost 1% daily. So every 24 hours and then every week, boom, I take a withdrawal, right? Every single week. And it's passive income that I'm making from my bond that I am the proud owner of, right? That's how that works. You can do it too. Anybody can do it. You've got bond series FP5, daily income of 1.1%. The term is two years. It accruals once every 24 hours, and the principal is included in the payments from $10,256. But now we're above the 1% daily reward, right? So it's, it's like large sums of money, right, coming in daily uh, from uh, owning that. Then you've got the Bond Series FP6, daily income 1.3%, term is two years, accruals once every 24 hours, principal included in payments from $25,640. You start getting into the more heavy hitting bonds. You've got the FP7, daily income, 
1.5%. Term, one year, accruals once every 24 hours, principal is included in payments from $51,280. And you've got the Bond Series FP8, daily income, 2%. The term is one year, accruals once every 24 hours, principal included in payments from $102,560, right? So that is the bonds that are currently available uh, going on with Shao Bank, right? So moving right along, uh, we want we do want to get into the next segment. And uh, so we talked about the partners, who, who they partner with. We talked about the actual banking right? And the financial reports. We talked about the bonds, right? That's where you're going to really be making a lot of money and in passive income. Uh, now we want to talk a little bit about the referral program. Then we're going to go over the bonus system, the legality of Shout Bank, the investment calculator, the marketplace, and then instructions for opening an account, buying bonds, and withdrawing profits. Okay. So let's go ahead and get into the uh, referral uh uh, part of the uh, uh, of the business. All right. So let me go ahead and go back to my screen share. Here we go. Okay. Business with Shao Bank. Expand your business network and receive extra income of up to 20% on your partner's bonds, uh, bond purchases. Right. So you can become a digital marketer and benefit from building a business network. That's what I do. Like with my YouTube channel and with my other networks, I I am a more or less a digital marketer. Right. I do product reviews. Right. And then I have my links available so that people can sign up if they so choose. Uh, you can become a digital marketer and benefit from building a business network with the activity of the partners. You also replenish your T balance in digital banking. Tokens are automatically added after bonds are purchased in your business network, which can be spent at your discretion in the marketplace. Uh, build your career. So find out more about becoming a digital marketer. Uh, over here on this side, we see it says invite a friend, get rewarded, take advantage of affiliate program opportunities and build your career. Maximum HKD commission, 20%. Total levels, 10 levels. Okay. Maximum token commission, 20%. Promotion online and offline. Build your career. Find out more about becoming a digital marketer. Build your business network and earn passive income. So your personal bank card is automatically credited with 20% of purchases of bonds by partners over 10 levels. The money is paid out of the marketing department's own cash fund. 21% of the bank's profits are distributed to digital marketers. The money can be used immediately and without any restrictions. Residents of any foreign country, right, that includes us, <laughs> can participate in the program. The benefits of developing a business network, simply do business. You don't need initial capital. You don't need an office. You don't need employees. You post a link to the bank's products on social media. Boom. Watch your team grow. A full-time passive income, right? Profits increase even if you are engaged in other businesses or on holiday. A transparent marketing system. Track the purchases of your partners and their invited friends in digital banking. Create a business network and receive tokens. You'll have up to 20% of your partner's bond purchases at the rate of HK1 through 12 tokens. And I'll show you guys how that works in a second. Tokens can be converted into real cash, which I've done, by the way. Uh, purchasing cases with Hong Kong dollars, you can use them as you see fit, invest in them, spend them, or send them to other customers of the bank. Here's Shao uh, Bank's loyalty program and how that works. Recommend Shao Bank bonds to your acquaintances. You profit from affiliate purchases made by your friends, and the business network generates income over 10 levels. Level 1, 7%. Level 2, 3%. Level 3, 2.5%. Level 4, 2%. Level 5, 1.5%. Level 6, 1%. And level 7, 1%. Level 8, 1%. Level 9, 0.5%. And last but not least, level 10.5%. And then you've also got your token accruals. One HKD equals 12 tokens. T balance is a bonus account. Now I've got a nice large bonus account right now. So I actually need to cash out some of my tokens. Maybe I'll do that here as well. Uh, like I said, I just need to be able to do it with a screen share without sharing you guys all of my, uh, without sharing with everybody, right? All of my banking information. All right, so let me go ahead and stop the share there. All right, so we got into that, and uh, that was the uh, the referral system. It's a very, very lucrative referral program. It's a nice referral program, and uh, we're going to go right on into the bonus system uh, with the tokens. 
So let me go ahead and open up that uh, screen share. And I believe it's this one here. Yep. Develop your business network and earn tokens. Take advantage of additional earning opportunities with Shao Bank and earn unlimited income. By purchasing corporate bonds, you save and increase your capital at a profit. Plus, you receive bonus tokens uh, added to your account up to 20% of your partner's bond purchases. At the rate of HK1 through 12 tokens, your T-balance can be exchanged for real money by buying cases with financial rewards from the bank. So let's get into that a little bit. So what is the T-balance? Right, The T-balance is a bonus account within your account. Right. It is topped up when your partners invest in Shao corporate bonds. Right. The T balance is a loyalty program. It's valid up to 10 levels deep. You don't have to have the time and knowledge to build a career. You can simply carry out your usual activities, watch your account balance increase and spend it on gift cases or by opening new levels in your business network. Uh, one HKD uh, equals 12 T. And then they do have a little video on how it works. If you guys want to check that out, just click the link in the chat that I gave you and uh, you'll be able to go over there and check it out. Build your business network and earn passive income. Your personal bank card is automatically credited with 20% of purchases of bonds by partners over 10 levels. The money is paid out of the marketing department's own cash fund. 21% of the bank's profits are distributed to digital marketers. The money can be used immediately and without any restrictions. And like I said, residents of any foreign country can use it. How to accrue a T balance. Step one, get an affiliate link, right? That's when you sign up, you'll get your link after you, you basically you're signing up with my link and then you'll get your own link once you sign up. Uh, step two, a friend buys bonds. Step three, your T-balance is replenished. Step four, you exchange your T-balance for reward cases, okay? Here's the T-balance costs and rewards. Uh, find out what percentage of the team securities purchases you can earn and how much it costs to open a particular level in the business network, all right? So opening levels on two, cost and tokens, 700 T, Percentage of bonds, 3%. Level 3, 2100 T, 2.5%. 2 level 4, 3500 T, 2%. Level 5, 7000 T, 1.5%. 1 level 6, 10,500 T, 1%. Level 7, th uh, 13,500 T, 1%. Level 8, 17,000 T, 1%. Level 9, 20,500 T, 0.5%. Level 10, 24,000 T, 0.5%. Then you get your cases. All right. Receiving gifts is always a pleasure. Buy cases and get HKD on your shout card. Now, the HKD, of course, translates into USD when you're doing your actual uh, fund uh, transactions. Right. You, you, I used I do mine in USDT, which is TRC20. It's USDT. It's Tether uh, USD. You got the common cases and you got the rare cases. Now, when you get a case, it's 1000 T and you get from four to 40 HKD and you do have to uh, you know, change the HKD to USD on the exchange rate. When you get the rare case, you get from 800 to 2400 HKD. You get the mystical case. You get from 2400 to 4800 HKD. You get the legendary case from 6000 to 12000 HKD and you get the immortal case from 12000 to 36000 HKD, right? And that gives you up to, right? 1 million, <laughs> 1 million T, 12,000 through uh, 36,000 HKD. Cryptocurrency rates analysis, Shao Bank uses, his, the, uses the national currency for all services. To find out the current rates of cryptocurrency, go to market analysis, and you can go here uh, by uh, actually clicking the site. Now, since I talked about that, I want to, I'm going to go ahead and stop the share for a second, because I want to go in and I want to show you what I got going on with my tokens while at the same time not actually showing you all of my personal banking information. So bear with me for one second. I'm going to go ahead and log into my account here. <clears throat> now, I do have my 2FA set up, and I recommend setting up 2FA on any crypto platform that you're involved in, whether it's Shao Bank or whatever else. Always set up your 2FA because that helps you not get hacked, right? Uh, the 2FA is an extra step in security. And I use the Google Authenticator to do my 2FA. So I'm logging into my shell bank now. And let me see what I can do. We did talk about the FP series bonds, which are quite amazing. Let me see if I can go to my T balance here. I've got a T balance of 96,209. Uh, right? So that's a lot of stuff. That's a lot of sauce that I've got in those T balances. Let me see if I can go to my T balance. Okay. So I think this is pretty good because this doesn't actually show. I'm going to buy one case. 
And then, well, maybe I should wait because I've got almost 100,000 T. And if I use that 100,000 T to buy a case, I'm going to get from 800 to 2400 HKD. So I'm actually going to let this grow a little bit, but I will show you. I will show you this portion so I can I, I can do that. Let me go ahead and do my screen share real quick. Let's see, careers, marketplace, screen. I guess we'll do screen. All right, here it is. So you can see this is me, Vaughn Morrill, and you can see that I've got a current balance of uh, 2,240 HKD, which translates to 287.17 USD. And uh, then I have my T balance of 96,000 uh, T. And you can see that I could buy a case right now for 1,000 T and I could get from 4 to 40 HKD, but I'm actually saving up to get this $100,000 case. Because the 100,000 T case will give me from 800 to 2400 HKD, right? And so if I, I and so what I can do for you here is I can do a real quick HKD to USD calculator, and then so on the very bottom of that, like let's say I had 800 HKD, well that's a hundred US dollars, right? So boom, just like that, I could get a hundred bucks, right? So that's what I'm going to wait for. Now, let's say that I get the higher end and I get the 2400 HKD because it's always kind of just like a, you don't know exactly what you're going to get when you open one of those up. Whoops. So the 2400 is actually 300 bucks, right? Not bad for a bonus. You see what I'm saying, guys? All right. So let me jump out of screen share and then we'll get uh, we'll get in into the next uh, the next uh, portion of the presentation. All right, so we did the tokens. We're going to now get into the legality, right? This is always fun. Uh, all right, let me go ahead and share this. I believe it's this screen here. Okay, here you will find all legal information at a glance. Shao Limited was established on September 28th, 2022 in Hong Kong, where its headquarters are still located. Since its founding, it's opened a branch in the United Kingdom, Shao Global Future Limited. The registered capital in Hong Kong is 7.76 billion HKD. And the registered capital in the United Kingdom is 989 million GBP. The business nature, SIC, includes banking, provision of credit by non-deposit financial institutions, and other specialized organizations providing consumer credit, securities trading, and commodity contracts. Legal status of Shao Bank. Shao operates within the legal framework, right? Bank complies with all the necessary regulations and requirements set forth by the relevant governing bodies, right? Here's the statutory documents, uh, checked by number of certificates with, with uh, state registers. And here are all of the document numbers. Shao is registered and authorized by the appropriate regulatory authorities. And once again, I'm reading directly from their website. This allows the bank to provide a wide range of financial services to its customers while maintaining transparency and accountability. The annual financial report is public on the bank's website. Bank has expanded its operations to the United Kingdom in compliance with the regulatory framework of the UK. Shao operates within the legal boundaries, ensuring that its services align with the financial regulations and international standards. The registered capital of Shao Bank is Hong Kong. Uh, in Hong Kong is 7.764 uh, billion HKD which demonstrates its financial stability and soundness. In the United Kingdom, the bank has a registered capital of 989 million GBP, further emphasizing its commitment to meeting the capital requirements imposed by the regulatory authorities. Chow, not under HKMA supervision, keep that in mind, Yang Shao has been CEO of Shao since, uh, Shao UK since May 12th. Shen Li is the CEO of uh, Hong Kong, in Hong Kong. Xiao has obtained an International Legal Entity Identifier, an LEI, which is a 20-character alphanumeric code based on the ISO 17442 standard developed by the International Organization for Standardization, the ISO. All right. It is linked to key reference information, enabling clear and unambiguous identification of legal entities moving forward in financial transactions. All assets of Xiao are tied to the business of Global Future Enterprise Group and are 100% secured by the asset of the corporation, including Financial Partners Limited, Go Insurance, Global Future Technology and Culture, 
and Universal Century. Overall, the legal status of Shao Bank is well established worldwide. The bank operates in accordance with the laws providing its customers with secure and compliant financial services. And here's the uh, certificates. All right. You've got the LEI certificate. You've got the ICRS certificate. You've got the IPLC certificate. You get the COI certificate. These documents are public in the Hong Kong and UK public registries, and you can contact them for more information. So why talk about the documents? Why get the documents? Why make copies of the documents? Because, guys, if something were to happen, you want to have all of this documented information so that, hey, you've got it there, right? That way, if anything ever did happen, you've got all the information that Xiao Bank presented to you. You say, hey, here's the bonds that I had. Here's what I owned. Here's the amount of money that I spent. Here's the documentation. Here's each and every document, right? I've got the certificate. I've got the ICRIS certificate. I've got the IPLC certificate. So that if you did ever need to go somewhere and say, hey, what, you know, how do I get my money out? You can show them that you've collected all this information. How do you get the information? Very simple, right? You get the information by clicking the link in my description and going to open up the, uh, you know, open up the site for yourself. You can download all the, every page that I'm showing you here is downloadable and accessible in the chat, in the link that I provided to you. All right, so let's go ahead and get out of that. Let's recap what we've talked about so far. We talked about uh, the Xiao Bank ecosystem. We talked about how Xiao Bank earns money. We talked about the bonds and the benefits of the bonds. We talked about the referral program. We talked about the tokens and the bonus system. And I showed you guys some of my tokens. We talked about the legality of Xiao Bank. Uh, now we're going to talk about the investment calculator. All right, so I'm going to go ahead and pull up the calculator. And it looks like in order to do that, I have to log in. So let me go ahead and do that real quick for you. So logging in again, and I'm going to use my 2FA again. Because you ought to have your 2FA on every platform. It protects you, right? It's an extra layer of security when you log in. It's a code that changes every 30 seconds or so. And for this one, I use uh, Google Authenticator to do it. All right. I'm now logged in. So now let me see if I can actually access that page that I'm trying to access, the investment calculator. Here it is. All right, so this is, let me see. Yeah, this is all in HKD. So we are going to have to pull back up the conversion screen. HKD to USD, not a problem. And I'll do mm, one or two examples here. All right, so here's the bonds. Uh, let's look at the one I have. I, I believe I've got the, uh, uh, I think it's FP three or four. Let's do it. Let's go with the FP three. Okay. Amount of bonds is 10. Uh, so the total income here uh, is 60,480 HKD and the amount payable is 8,000 HKD. All right. So when does it expire? March 1st, 2027. All right. So. It's a three-year period. It yields 0.7% every day. It costs 8,000 HKD. So let's go ahead. I believe that's 1,000 USD, but let me go ahead and plug it in. Yeah, so it costs about 1,000 bucks, guys, right? And then at the end of the term, this is this is really where the sauce comes into play, guys. So it costs 1,000 bucks. It's a three-year term. And then what does it do? At the end of the term, you've turned that 1,000 into seven thousand seven hundred twenty nine dollars and thirty four cents all right now let's look at the one i have this one costs about five thousand uh and then this is what it turns it into this is also a three-year period so it costs about five thousand and then at the end of the day you've turned your five thousand into almost fifty thousand dollars boom that's the power of this guys hopefully you're tracking with me 
Why are they being so generous? Because they're trying to grow their product. They're trying to grow their service. They're growing their company. And right now, we're in a period of explosive growth. And because of that, we're able to get these types of generous offers. Right? So it's one of those things where you kind of want to strike while the iron's hot. Okay. So we covered that. Uh, next up, we want to cover the marketplace. So I'm going to go ahead and go over to the marketplace. And uh, we did kind of cover this already, but I will go over it again for you. This is about the T, uh, the T coins and uh, how that all works. So we'll, we'll go over that one more time. All right. So you got the common case. It's 1,000 T. You get from 4 to 40 HKD. You've got the rare case. It's 100,000 T. You get from 800 to 2,400 HKD. You can get the mystical case. It costs 200,000 T. And by the way, you get these you get these T tokens when you're doing activity, like when you're, you're bringing in referrals or you're purchasing bonds, you're doing deposits, you're doing withdrawals. So every action that plus on the holidays, every action that you do gives you a little bit more of these T coins. And then you can buy these cases. Mystical, 2,400 through 4,800 mm -hmm. HKD. Legendary, 6,000 through 12,000 HKD, or you can get the Immortal from 12,000 to 36,000 HKD, right? So in that case, if you do ever build up a million, right? If you ever do build up a million T, let me see if I can do my HKD to USD calculator on that. That gives you about uh, $4,000. So that's pretty amazing. And that's all, that's all bonus, guys. It's all bonus. Now you've got your referral levels, level one, 7% HKD in tokens. Level two, 3% HKD in tokens. Level three, 2.5% HKD in tokens. Uh, level four, 2% HKD in tokens, 3,500. Level five, 1.5% HKD, 7,000 tokens. Uh, level six, 1% HKD, 10,000 plus tokens. Level seven, 1% HKD, 13,000 plus tokens. Level 8, 1% HKD, 17,000 tokens. Level 9, 0.5% HKD, 20,000 plus tokens. Level 10, 0.5% HKD, 24,000 tokens. So it really wants to show you uh, that you can unlock all of these levels, right, as you're, as you're going through the referral system. You can unlock the levels. You can get the tokens. Uh, so there's just a lot of different ways to make passive income uh, with Shout Bank. And really, that, that, that's the deal. Okay, that's the deal. So uh, let's go back into this and see uh, what else we want to discuss here. We talked about the marketplace. And now it looks like, uh, okay. Now we want to go over the instructions. And uh, I am going to look at what I can show you here, guys. So bear with me for just a second. So when you open up an account, you're going to get a card. And that card is going to have a 16-digit a, 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 a card number, card number. It's going to be a digital bank card. It's going to have an expiration date, and it's also going to have a CVC on the back. And you're going to need all of that information, right, in order to access your funds, right? So let me show you my funds without showing you my actual card. And we'll see how this works out. Okay, so here you go, guys. I've got uh, 2,240 HKD currently. That's uh, equal to $287.17 USD. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to initiate a withdrawal, right? And I'm going to in initiate a withdrawal for my entire amount. Okay, 2240. I'm going to plug in my wallet address, and then I'm going to go to my next step, which is going to be putting in my card information. Okay, so at this point, I'm going to stop the screen share. And now I am going to kind of talk you through what I'm doing here. I'm going to put in my uh, wallet address for USDT. Click on next step. And it's going to ask me to give my payment CVC code, which is the three digits on the back of my card. I do have that memorized. 
I'm going to be getting a total of $273 from this withdrawal. And it says success. Your withdrawal request has been successfully sent and will be processed shortly. All right. So let me uh, let me see here. I'm going to erase my wallet address. Oh, nope, it's not going to let me do that. I'm trying to see what how I can show this to you guys without giving up all my info. <laughs> All right. I can't. Okay, so you're just going to have to take my word for it. Uh, I did do the withdraw, and uh, let's see if I can get any other uh, info here. Usually it lets me know when I've initiated a withdrawal. So I'll get a communication from Shao Bank letting me know that I've initiated my withdrawal and then letting me know when my withdrawal comes in. So let's see what else we have to uh, go over with you guys. I just want to make sure that I hit on everything. Okay, so instructions from opening for opening an account. Well, just simply click the link that I gave you in the chat, uh, and then you just follow the instructions, open up your account. Once you do open up your account, you can click on bonds, and that's where you can actually purchase bonds. And then the bonds automatically grow. So all you have to do is log into your account you know, every day, and you can see the money that you've made. Uh, log in every week and you can see the payout of the actual bonds. And then if you want to go ahead and go in and um, make a withdrawal, you can do that every week. So every seven days as your bond accruals, boom, you can put in a withdrawal, right? I withdraw at least once a week. Uh, sometimes I withdraw from this multiple times per week. Uh, but it's just one of those projects that has been lasting a really long time. As you guys can see from the broadcast here, they've got a lot going for them. Okay. And uh, all right. Somebody sent me their email. <laughs> Thank you. All right. So as you can see there, you, you know, Shell Bank's got a lot going for them, right? They, they're, they're doing a lot. They've got a big, robust, powerful business. And uh, I'm, I'm very happy with it. I mean, I got to tell you, I, I've been uh, with this since last year. And it's just been working with no drama, no problems whatsoever. The culture is great. There's a lot of great people with the company. And there's an air of professionalism about Xiao Bank that I really like, right? Because if you're part of the, the world of crypto, you know that not every project is professional, right? There's a lot of unprofessional projects out there. But this one has a good air of professionalism. Uh, let me go ahead and open up my crypto wallet. I'm going to open up my crypto wallet to see if my uh, if my withdrawal has come in. Usually it comes in pretty fast. And then I will be also sharing the replay on my uh, on my channel as well. So for those of you who are interested in that, I'll be sharing that replay on the channel. USDT. All right, so let me go ahead and open it up for questions. I see that somebody did send me a uh, a message here with your email address. Uh, thank you for that. All right, so uh, if anybody has any questions, now is the time. And uh, we will go ahead and get into any type of Q&A that you have. So if you do have any questions about the presentation, just go ahead and let me know. Uh, once again, if you would like to join, let me see if I still have that same link. I will post the link up again one more time in the chat for those of you who are interested in joining Shell Bank. Here we go. And I'll also go ahead and put up a link to the training. There you go, guys. All right. Uh, from uh, Tricorium, we have, sorry I was late, but are they trading crypto or where do the accruals come from? Okay. So with Shao Bank, and let me actually, uh, that's a good question. So let me go ahead and pull that up uh, one more time. And uh, I've, got, I've got an actual link that shows everything that they're involved with. So let me find that real quick. Here we go. 
And then let me just turn on my screen share real quick for you. All right, so here's how they make their money. Basically, it's an online digital bank, right? Uh, they handle the finances the way that you're used to, right? They make deposits, they invest in bonds, take out insurance policies with Shell Bank, uh, register a personal account and manage your money from your mobile device, uh, laptop, tablet, or smartphone anywhere in the world. They've got their bank statements here. And what they do is they join with various businesses uh, in order to make their money. So they are with a couple of big businesses, okay? Xiao Bank is a subsidiary of a Chinese corporation called Global Future Enterprise Group. Now, one of the things that they're working on, uh, um, uh, Tricorium, is a uh, nanotechnology, right? Basically, what nanotechnology is, is the technology for microchips. That's one of the things that their Global Future Enterprise, Enterprise Group is involved in. There's a lot of manufacturing that happens in China, right? I mean, you've got China's basically the manufacturing capital of the world. Uh, it is a modern, mobile, and fast-growing bank. Focuses on online services. Um, and then let's see. Xiao Bank shares of capital is used to finance microloan outlets in Hong Kong. So they're in the, the, the loan business. And uh, they're also involved with these activities of this group, Global Future Enterprise Group. All companies in the corporation's ecosystem are regulated. And uh, there are a number of companies. And let me see. This, uh, let me see. I'm sure there's a uh, there's a page here that shows that. Let me let me go back and find that real quick for you. Uh, partners. Here we go. This should be it. Yeah, here we go. So this is going to be like the exact answer to your question. Let me share that real quick. All right, here they are. So they're they're partnered with these groups. This is Global Future Enterprise Group. This is the parent company. Uh, they handle banking, insurance, and investments. They're also partnered with this company called Go Insurance. It's a, subsi a subsidiary of Financial Partners Limited. Provides life, health, account, and business insurance services. Now, life insurance is, is big, big business. There's a lot of money in life insurance, uh, let me tell you. All right, so let me see if I can show you this while we're talking. There you go. That's my uh, 273 bucks that I just pulled out of Shell Bank. Just came in. And I, I do that multiple times a week, guys. Uh, financial Partners Limited is an investment company, part of the Global Future Enterprise Group Corporation. It operates in the financial insurance sectors. You've got Beijing Global Future Technology and Culture. Uh, it's a Class A enterprise, and it's a tech company. It's a Chinese tech company, right? <laughs> he works for a Chinese tech company. You've got Universal Century in Beijing. It's an advertising agency. And uh, so they're, you know, so we've got advertising, we've got technology, we've got life insurance, uh, we've got banking. And then this is an investment group. So, I mean, they've got their hands in a lot of pies. And what they're doing is they're really bringing in a large amount of, or, or trying to bring in a large amount of customers with these bank bonds, man, because these bank bonds pay out, these digital bonds pay out a lot of money, right? And so they're, they're, they're serious about trying to grow. All right. So it looks like we had that one question, which was a very good question, by the way. I have, once again, I've posted up my link in case anybody wants to join. I've also posted up some training uh, from YouTube. Uh, you can join on there as well. Uh, now, I will go ahead and share my uh, my YouTube channel as well, because I am going to be posting this entire presentation on there uh, as soon as it's, you know, as soon as I get the recording back. So let me, first of all, find my channel. Here we go. All right. See, this is going to studio. I don't want to give you that link. All right. Well, here it is. All right. So here's also, this is a link to my YouTube channel. And uh, that's well, where you can see the, I, I will be putting on the full, uh, the full broadcast okay, on there yeah, well, in uh, just a little while. Wow. 
All right. Do we have any other questions? Did you say USDT TRC20? Yep, that's what I use. But, uh, you know, you can use Bitcoin, right? You can use Ethereum. You can use whatever cryptocurrency you're comfortable with. But what I use is I use USDT TRC20. <laughs> I like using USDT TRC20 because Bitcoin, obviously, as you know, Bitcoin can be very volatile, right? One day it's up at 74,000 and the next day it falls down to 67,000. And it's like, with USDT, you just it's it's tethered to the United States dollar, so the the price doesn't fluctuate too much. And when I'm dealing with a passive income opportunity like Shao Bank, I personally don't want to be paid in Bitcoin. This is not Bitcoin for me. This is USDT connected to the USDT. Let me know what I'm gonna make, right? If I'm making a couple hundred dollars a week, or if I'm making a thousand a week, or whatever it is. I like it to be on USDT because that way I know the exact amount of money I'm making. If I want to go and, and, and swap that over to Bitcoin, I can, right? But but personally, I prefer to be paid in USDT. So that's, uh, and yes, and, and as far as USDT goes, I do prefer uh, TRC20. Got a few minutes left, guys. Uh, if there are any more questions, the the presentation has been completed here. But if you guys do have any more questions, I'd be happy to answer those. Uh, so we'll just hang out for a couple of minutes here, see if any questions come in. I mean, I got paid super fast, right? That was like five minutes, maybe 10, right? 10 minutes at the most. And like I said, I've just never really had any issues getting paid from Shell Bank. Uh, they're, they're, they're one of the more responsible uh, companies. And uh, let me show you this. I can show you this because this does not have any personal information. So let me go ahead and pull this up. I'm going to share my screen real quick and I'm going to show you my uh, my um, receipt because they give you a receipt to your email. And there it is. Uh, and Shao Bank, hello, Von Moral, transfer of associate, uh, tr transfer, transfer of assets, right, from Shao Bank card to your cryptocurrency wallet successfully completed. And here's the transfer amount, $273 USDT TRC20. Okay. And then it has a link to go back to your account at that point. All right. We have a question from Desiree Edwards. The FP bonds ends the 31st of March. Do you have the rates on the next set of bonds? Not yet, but that but that's why you want to uh, stay tuned to my channel there. So uh, make sure that you, uh, uh, you know, <laughs> shameless promotional plug here. Uh, please like and subscribe to my YouTube channel because that way, as soon as the new bonds come out, of course, I'm going to drop a video on there and let you know uh, what's up. But for right now, the FP bonds are still good until the end of March. So there is still time to get a hold of those, which I think is a good idea. It, it's always a good idea. I mean, the new bonds are going to have different terms. Right. So if you like the terms on the FP bonds, uh, now's the time to get into it. Right. Or you can get like the and another thing I like about this is you can get in for as low as fifty dollars. Right. I mean, that's awesome. So, I mean, even if you don't want to, you know, if you don't want to, like, put in a whole lot, I mean, you could probably get fifty dollars worth. I mean, it's it's just not that much money. And that's what's cool about the FP bond uh, bond series. But I'm definitely excited to see what the new bonds are as well. And like I said, as soon as those come out, I'll be I'll be letting you know on my channel. All good questions, guys. All good questions. All right. Everything's looking good. Uh, doesn't look like there's any more questions coming in right now. So uh, just wish you guys a great day. Have a great rest of your day. Uh, and stay tuned to the YouTube channel because, like I said, once this recording is finished and I actually get the copy of it in Zoom, I'm going to go ahead and post it up on the YouTube channel as well so you can uh, watch it again. And we will be back uh, at the same time next week. So it's going to be every Friday at the same time. We're going to be doing this event. Make sure that you bring some friends, you know, contact anybody who you think would be interested. If you are trying to uh, bring a team or grow a team, this is a great place to bring that team, right? Because all the information is here in one place and they can ask questions and then they can join and it saves you the trouble of like having to go and do a full-blown presentation. All right. We'll see you guys next time, and uh, hopefully I will see you over there at my channel, and uh, we'll talk to you guys later. Take care.